Police are investigating tonight after they say an attempted robbery turns deadly in Henderson. Good evening and thanks for joining us tonight at 11 o'clock. I'm Sasha Loftus. This all happened just before 4 a.m. near Gibson and Galleria. That's where we find 8 News Now reporter Madison Kimbrough. She's been covering this all day. She's live tonight with the latest. Madison. Sasha Henderson police are investigating this as a homicide, but also sharing that the shooting happened in self defense. You can take a look behind me where you can see the apartment complex we're talking about and those who live nearby shaken up by the series of events that took place early this morning. We saw it on the ring app early in the morning, like everybody was kind of freaking out in the neighborhood. There was a shooting going on. Some people said it was a robbery. Anthony Robinson lives at the Well Apartments in Henderson and says it was absolute chaos Saturday as Henderson police arrived on scene. I heard like two or three sirens. At first I thought, okay, maybe they're going to the hospital, but then I'm like, there's too many sirens going on. So it was alarming to hear that at four o'clock in the morning. Henderson police reporting that a man with a gun approached another man outside, demanding he give him his cell phone and wallet. That's when that man who was approached pulled out his own gun and shot the alleged suspect multiple times in self-defense. When Henderson police and paramedics arrived on scene, the alleged suspect was found lying on the ground dead. You know, you see out here as much. Those who live nearby say this is typically a quiet area where they feel safe. So for this to happen is disturbing. Um, I've walked this area by myself multiple times, but at the same time, the way this world is going, yeah. self-defense is understandable. Yeah, it is definitely unsettling as you think about it. You know, something this close, because, I mean, you live here, you hear a shooting nearby, it's not going to make you feel good, right? The man who killed the alleged suspect remained on scene and is cooperating with police, but detectives are still investigating this as a homicide at this time. As obviously, the person who was protecting himself needed a weapon, but obviously the person who was trying to commit a robbery doesn't, should not have a weapon. So it, it's extremely tough when you're t having these conversations. Those we spoke to say they would like to see more nightly security around the premises in addition to better lighting in and around the complex. As you can see, it is pretty dark out here. Reporting near Gibson and Galleria, Madison Kimbrough, 8 News Now. Madison, thank you for that. Now, this is the sixth homicide in Henderson's jurisdiction so far this year.